気を抜くと思わぬ行動をとってしまいそうだ<笑>全部<笑><笑>そ、so, う、um,、now for this video, we're gonna talk about insanity. We're going to discuss insanity. You know? So, there's two different types of insanity. And these are examples that I've also acquired from anime. See, a lot of people have to stop just looking at anime just from the just from the superficial standpoint of just the action and all of that and actually look deeper into what's going on as far as when the circle of events play out. So let's talk about insanity. There's two types of insanity. You have insanity, you have people who was born insane, and then you have people where they developed to being insane. My point in case. In the show, Soul Eater, there's a character by the name of Dr. Stein. Dr. Stein was born insane. When he was born, he was insane. Even as a kid, he was insane. He's a, he's a, he's a mad scientist who loves to dismember people and dissect people and conduct experiments on people. Kind of similar to Orochimaru. But Orochimaru wasn't born insane. He, he developed into that. But Dr. Stein was born with mental health issues. He was born like that. You know? See, we live in a world, even myself, where we judge people on things that they can't control. He can't control that. So, Dr. Stein in the series of Soul Eater desperately tries to control himself. And to not let, not let his insanity run wild because he realizes that it's wrong. Dr. Stein realizes that him, you know, dismembering people and being a psychopath, he realizes that it's wrong and he doesn't want to do it. But that's how he's fucking born. Even though he realizes it's wrong, he loves to do it. He, he loves to dismember people. He loves to chop people up. Like on some Jeffrey Dahmer type shit. But he can't help it. He was born like that. And he's, he's, a, a, he's a case of a person who was born insane. Right? Let's get back to Jeffrey Dahmer. Jeffrey Dahmer... Based on what I've heard, because I haven't really looked too much into his backstory, but based on what I heard from him, people say he was also born insane. Even as a kid, they were saying he was showing symptoms of being a psychopath. Because people say that um, if if you like, people say that if they if you have a kid that likes to kill animals and shit, like Michael Myers, who in the movie Michael Myers, where people who like to kill animals, you know. They say that that is they that is the beginning stages of a psychopath. If you like to kill animals and shit, and Michael Myers, I actually seen the Michael Myers. He was killing animals as a kid. That was those were signs showing early on. All of us are born, like I said in my last video, we're all born with different things that we like and dislike. We're all born with that. You may like men. You may like women. You may like basketball. You may like hockey. We all like different shit. Some people are born evil. That's just how they're born. There's none. That's just how they were. That's how they were born. Some people are born evil. Some people have the natural inclination to cause harm to others. Right? Some people are born like that. They're born with the natural inclination to harm others whereas some people have the natural inclination to help others like myself being a good person is something that i can't control that's how i'm born me helping someone gives me that dopamine rush you know just gives me a dop dop dopamine rush whereas some people doing good stuff it's doing good stuff 
it's, you know, and me being a good person, I can't cause suffering on someone else because that would make me feel a certain kind of way, make me feel bad. That's suffering to me. Whereas on the flip side, you have people that get a dopamine rush of harming others and doing good things is suffering to them. Now, I would say these people are in the minority of people, but there's still people out there that's like that. You know, and there's nothing there's nothing you can do to stop them from thinking, that you know, that kind of way, man. You know, all of us are born different, you know. So, um, that's how Dr. Stein's born. And, you know, he, he was born insane, right? You know, and we judge people, even myself included, for being insane when that's how they were fucking born. <laughs> they don't have no choice but to be born like that, you know? And... <laughs> And in the show, Dr. Stein has a partner named Maria. Maria is Dr. Stein's partner in the show. Oh, nice shoot. So, and she has a super positive wavelength that keeps his evilness under control keeps his madness under control keeps him sane and i believe that okay okay and then let's get back to sasuke because th 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 this is going to all correspond into a big pit to a big picture Sasuke was not born insane. Sasuke Uchiha was born a good person. But circumstances throughout his life drive him to become mad, drive him to become a maniac. Due to witnessing his brother slaughter the fucking clan twice through the Genjutsu Sukiyomi, he experienced it twice. And that was what allowed him. You know, seeing that, you know, his brother, seeing his clan be slaughtered and seeing his brother betray him, seeing how his brother betrayed him, you know, one of his favorite people, seeing how his brother betrayed him, you know, that is what drove him mad, drove him into the madness, you know, is seeing all the people that he knows and love get slaughtered. And the person who did it was not was his was his beloved brother. That's what drew him to the depths of madness. You know, so Sasuke was not born insane. He developed to being insane. It was developed. I would say that, you know, like I said in my last video titled how a job ruins your life, I'm starting to develop into being insane. I'm starting to develop into it because it's just life is stressing me the fuck out to where I'm developing to being a, a fucking maniac. You know, I, I'm nowhere near as close as Sasuke and Dr. Stein's madness. Nowhere near that. <laughs> I don't have any urge to harm anybody or nothing like that. But I'm saying that I'm developing into being a fucking maniac. It's 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 starting to it's starting to consume me. You know, <laughs> realizing this, how shitty this life is, I'm starting to develop into a fucking psychopath, man. And I and I ain't, and I and I wasn't born a psychopath. You know, I'm starting to develop into one. You know, <laughs> you know. And side so, and side note, in the show, Doctor Stein, like like I say, has Maria, and there's a girl that I met that I'm talking to recently. And like I said, I'm not going to put all of my faith into her, none of that, because anything could happen. But she's a girl that, 
is very nice. And even though she's not anywhere as smart as me, just her gentle nature and her gentle, kind spirit keeps me mentally sane. And it kind of, it kind of, uh, it kind of contains my madness from fucking spreading out. You know, jobs, these nine to five jobs and the concept of money is going to drive me insane. You know, is you know, I'm, you know, it's just like, like I said, my, my insanity, I'm not really insane yet. I'm just saying if this shit continues of me having to work a job, man, and having to be a wage slave, I'm going to become insane. I'm going to become insane. I'm, I'm, I'm not fucking joking. This is I'm not fucking over exaggerating. I'm being dead ass. If this wage slavery continues for any longer, I'm going to become a fucking maniac like Sasuke. Now, I'm not like in Shippuden. I used to hate Sasuke in, in Naruto Shippuden, but I understand him now, man. I understand why he became a fucking maniac. I understand him now, man, even more than ever now. I understand why he became a maniac. This world drives you to, to become a fucking maniac. It drives you to become a psycho, man. It drives you to do this. The world drives you, pushes you to be a fucking maniac. You know, this fucking evil fucking world just drives your ass to be a fucking maniac, dog. You know? So, the girl I'm talking to, her, her, her kind nature is is containing my madness because like i said in my last video if if this shit continues for another year most likely i will be driven to insanity the 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 tea sizzle that you see today will no longer exist because even though i have i have a strong Even though I have a strong will and a strong mental barrier, there's only so much I can take, man. You know? Even though my, my, my mental barrier is very strong, I can see it breaking if I continue this bullshit. Being a wage slave, being a nine to five flunky. This nine to five slavery is gonna drive me to be a fucking maniac. Uh. And, and, and that's not my natural nature. This world drives you against your fucking natural nature, man. That's all I want to say about the about the differences of insanity. Because I can see myself mentally. <laughs> you know, I'm still somewhat sane now. I'm still somewhat sane now. But I'm just saying, if this shit continues, man, I, I can see myself breaking. Mentally breaking like how an Obito absorbed the tintail. And then you saw his fucking mind breaking apart. <laughs> That's going to be me if I keep being a nine to five slave. This this is how much a nine to five job can just destroy your ass, destroy your fucking mental health. I can see myself being a fucking maniac. You know, now at this point, I have a newfound respect for psychopaths. I have a newfound respect and I understand psychopaths now. I don't really I don't really fuck with psychopaths, but I understand them now. I don't, I don't really fuck with them, you know. You know, you're not going to catch me hanging out with psychopaths and hanging out with people like that. But I understand where they're coming from. As far as the people who were born like that and the people who just developed into it due to certain traumatic experiences that led them down that path. Because I understand Sasuke Uchiha way more than what I way more than what I used to because I used to thought I understood him, which I kind of did, but I didn't fully understand him until now. He, he he's a psychopath because the world driven his ass to be a fucking psycho. Because as a kid, he was just a sweet kid. All he wanted to do was be a good ninja and impress his father and brother. That's all he wanted to do. But the world changed his ass. 
turn him into a fucking monster. And and I can see myself becoming like that if if I don't fucking escape this shit, man. I can see myself going down that same path if I don't get the fuck out this shit. I can see that shit happening, man. I'm being de- I'm, I'm 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 not fucking joking. I'm being serious. Mental health awareness should not be I mean, now as of recently mental health awareness has been getting a lot of attention, but mental health awareness by by any means should not be something that people should overlook. By any means, it should not be overlooked. This shit's serious, man. It's it's fucking serious. <laughs> it's not it's not a laughing matter. I'm not over exaggerating. I'm being dead serious. I'm not over exaggerating. If I don't get the fuck out of this, man, I'm I'm going to lose my I'm going to lose the little sanity I have left. So, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So I'm just, I'm just, I'm just being honest, man, because I've I've always been a sane person, but if this shit continues, man, my sanity's gonna go away, and you, and you might see my ass in a fucking straight jacket, locked up in a fucking mental hospital. Now I, I have a newfound respect for mental ass motherfuckers. I don't want to fuck with mental ass crazy ass motherfuckers, but I understand they ass. I'm not gonna fuck with they crazy ass, but now I understand they ass. You know what I'm saying? Real talk. So, that's all I wanted to say, man. Y'all have a wonderful day. It's raining out here, nigga. I'm about to see if I can get my mental health in check, nigga. Because if Sasuke, Naruto, and Gara overcame th- their darkness in the series, if, if they was able to overcome their darkness, then hopefully I should be able to overcome my darkness. It's just going to take some time. They didn't overcome their darkness in just a day, you know? So, I'm going to try to take preventative measures to stop myself from becoming a psychopath because I can feel that shit coming up, man. And I, and I'm not fucking joking. See, you know, even though I'm talking, you guys might not be able to feel my emotions, but nigga, I'm, I'm being, I'm not joking, bro. This is not a fucking joke at all. So y'all have a great day. I'm out. Peace out.